fancy hardware. What a fancy coffee machine you have. Do you brew it for people in another special folder? I operate this machine when Mr. CEO wants me to. Let him take my free advice. It's harmful to drink a lot of coffee. Caffeine helps Mr. CEO to get through the thrill when the stock exchange rises. Hello, ma'am. Can I see Mr. CEO? Identify yourself. Name, age, bank account balance. Well, okay. Angelo. Older than you think. And why the hell you need my balance? <laughs> Mr. CEO won't speak with you if your fortune isn't big enough to make him drool. Listen. I have a message from his very important message. Believe me. Mr. Angelo, I trust nothing but papers only, not even the internet. I classify people by two folders with journals. One carries the list of visitors. It's always on my left. The second one is for checking special personnel who fix, clean, and are being paid poorly. Always on my right side. So just drop a line in the visitors list. It is impossible. Visitors can be added only by Mr. CEO's direction or to comply with his requirements. You look like a teenager who doesn't know what to do. Also, you're neither rich enough nor famous, and there's no dirty work here that I can give you either. Look, I'm a blogger. It is very useful for Mr. CEO to talk with me for his public image. That's true. Report to me the number of your subscribers. Um, a million. Almost. Sorry, Mr. Angelo. Only numbers starting from three million can make Mr. CEO grin. <coughs> Did you hear all that lady said? I'm a bit afraid of her. No, too suspicious. People will shout such big increase in subs. In the end, I'll get more unsubscribes. Where is this money coming from? Stolen? It's hard to say this, but no. I'm planning to return to my world and don't want to meet that account holder. <laughs> Please avoid unauthorized touching of anything here. Maybe I need to visit the WC? I don't have you on the WC visitors list. <laughs> it says, young sharks required to eat people. You need to graduate from an expensive college to touch them, young man. I saw your company is recruiting. How can I apply? What can you do? Well, I can ask people to donate to me while I'm relaxing. This skill can be marked as acceptable. Please give me your email. And the computer will send you an application form. <laughs> I'll have to use it, before I can make it unworkable.
All right, do your trick. Make her boss cry while looking at his screen. I love to do the same for my viewers. <laughs> One change is done. Journals changed. Repeat the procedure. <coughs> oh no, the machine isn't working. You didn't try! Papers never lie, young man. But I have to bring Mr. CEO a coffee. It's a matter of life and death. Literally. Well, I can deal with that machine, lady. Believe me. You really can? I was going to call a service, but you could try. Fix it faster. I'll try to calm him down with news about his competitor's bankruptcy. That's the kind of job I can handle. Okay, lady. Your infernal machine is fixed. But orders are orders. I must list you as a worker. Your name again? Angelo. Just Angelo. Is there some reward for helping? Do it again. I need her out one more time. <laughs> Server security? Firewalls? IP tracers? Now the journals are back in their places. Could you check the visitors list again, please? Maybe you'll find my name. I checked not long ago, Mr. Angelo, and you weren't there. But you did me a favor, so as an exception, I'll look into it again. Hmm. Weird. Now I see your name, written by me. Is that some kind of trick? Papers don't lie, remember? You may enter Mr. CEO's office, Mr. Angelo. <coughs> Hello, Mr. Rich. You have 30 seconds for free. 
Then you either tell something useful for me, or pay me for talking. I can't help looking at your chair. I was expecting some classic seat, with maybe dragon's leather. The world is now functioning digitally. I need to see it naked and helpless. Got some VR trick to make people naked? My world's body is made up of my real estate. Money circulates in its veins. I am the brain. Do you have some kind of training in how to make money? Sure, I can teach you how to earn a million. It'll cost you two million. What's the sense in that? Then using that million, you earn three million and make a profit. Got the logic? It looks more like a battle plan than economics. Everything in the world is a battle. I have a message from your dad. Wait, what? Is my dear father alive? Well, I talked to him, but not sure about his physical status. So who the hell are you? I'm a messenger from hell. Well, well, well. So my dearest father is where he belongs. Great news. Now we can talk for free. What message did he send? He wants to warn you about his partners, who poisoned him. You have to look inside the Midas statue for papers that can help you withstand them. Good. So good. Glad to hear you're happy. But you have to tell me the password. Kind of delivery confirmation. Sure. But first, let me give another message to him. It was I who poisoned him. You? But why? Weren't you rich enough? Being his son! I was following his lessons. He always told me to be about profit before anything else. I found dirt on our competitors inside the Midas statue. It wasn't a very creative stash. I set up Daddy's partners with Father's death, used the dirt to finish off their business, and got on top. I've implemented the most effective plan, in which Dad was... an obstacle. Now I'm even better than my father. He can be proud. Oh, and about your password. Deceive. Inveigle. Obfuscate. Hacker, please take me back to hell, cause I'm scared. Now, I know Kung Fu. Good news! You're not alone. Call this number. It's the cure for loneliness. <sighs> I recall a girl on the street told me the same thing, and then... Don't continue, please. We'll shoot your story real good for my channel later. Work's done, boss, but there is a small detail. Cut the crap! Is my boy all right? Not bad, for sure. He tells you, deceive, inveigle, obfuscate. Oh, I'm such a proud father. My little nestling learned to fly. Damn, your family is a nest of vultures. Okay, boys. A deal is a deal. 
See that skull in the aquarium? There's a stamp inside that's required to exit hell. Very unexpected move for fish to talk in Japanese, right? It was my homeland. I lost it, but not my honor. You were some kind of a guard, right? I was the shadow over my demo. He's the most loyal person, and he's God. Were you a samurai? Right, samurai. It won't be easy to deal with you. But if you are here, doesn't it mean that you're dead already? My body, but not my spirit. When Master died, and his relics ended up here, my duty was to follow. I fear his death was my fault. And the only way my spirit can be free is a sacred death. So maybe we can kill you? Just a thought. No! I must do it myself. <sighs> but it is not possible in my current life. I have no hands. Also, this room is a soul proof. No soul can leave its walls. Stay afloat.